Oh. <laughs> All right, Quarry. What is we on chapter? Chapter four. Last chapter. If you missed chapter three, we finally had some action. Shit got a little crazy. I was a little scared. I don't know what's about to happen now. Let's jump right into it. Oh, matter of fact, let me check. Cause I was turning music. Every time I heard somebody singing, I turned music off. Did it? It looks like it worked. We gonna keep doing that. We gonna keep that same format. Here come the cat. You gonna climb on me when I'm in the middle. Okay. That was horrible. It was. It it was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast and, and there was a, uh, there was a hunter and it was just. Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Well, uh, can you draw what attacked you? Okay. Oh. So, 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 so. Nick, hey, buddy, can you tell me what those guys did to you? Why the f I'm sorry. Why the fuck is everybody still outside? Gosh, did. He's super out of it. Yeah. The, the, the hunter. Uh, yeah, there was a guy. There was something else. Some kind of animal. What kind of animal? No, no, I only saw a dude trying to take him away. He's probably just disoriented, that's all. The dude was massive and angry. Is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Because teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. Full-size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I, I thought we don't get bears right here. Uh, oh fuck! Look at that. Oh fuck. shit! That black stuff. That's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. They touching that shit. <laughs> hey. We should amputate. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. Man, what the hell you think this is? What? Hell no! Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What? What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? Shut the fuck up! Sorry. Oh my goodness. Oh. Remember much? I mean, I don't even know about performing amputation. not calling out again bro are oh, the whole gang is already wait jacob who's not here Stay we're missing a couple Shh. ryan what if it's jacob or emma what if it's not be careful it was probably nothing yeah but is it gone? Yeah, you better run. Very brave. All right. So, uh, Lodge is sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? Wait, no, 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 no. Don't shoot, don't shoot. I'm here to save you. Holy shit. Nick. 
Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. <sighs> Fuck, of course they are. I mean, this would be a good time for him to explain that a big guy with overalls and muscles had a trap and cut him down. I mean, are you? Are we? They're not very great at sharing information across all the people. Why are they talking in little mini groups of pain? Jacob, where's Emma? Fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ! Um, I I left Emma on the island, and I told her I'd be right back. Ouch! Wait, the island? Yeah. Why? Well, no. I just, I just thought I saw someone over there before. Someone? No. I, you know, I, I don't know. It's it's probably nothing. I left her out there alone. Well, I think we're gonna head to the lodge. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? Oh, yeah, no, um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with like, um, he had like a bottle thing. I don't know, dude. It's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah, no, it's super fucked up. I gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Get! Just let it go. Let him have it. <laughs> I got to be ready at all times. He just socked me. Come on, man. I I wasn't ready. I you fucking stop. We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks, both of you. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Ryan. Sorry. This is bullshit. Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. You don't know that. And what, Nobody. another uh, run-in with Captain Deliverance? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zip line. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. We need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. How? Nick can't walk properly. Yeah, I have an idea. tonight brings okay here's a riddle for you what's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark this fool well one thumb one available thumb okay and it was here on a strange uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I wanna go back because I don't, but even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. You know what, sorry, I'm bending. Well, explore bending. You know what, fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. <laughs> yeah, she has no idea what's going on though. Jacob? I feel like that 
that was your man's. Hey, the magician. Remember, I found the star. Wait, let's replay this. giving us a clue because i think when they show those those are opportunities for you to die and it shows you what to do when you're given the decisions i think no prizes for guessing what these are can't say that I've used them. A little too au naturel for me, TBH. You know, I've never thought about where the waste goes. Oh. Oh, please, God, no. Okay, we're gonna just go ahead and ignore that. shelter it's a shelter where you meet at okay i'm trying really hard to make this interesting but sometimes a thing just is what it is i think i've made my point i can't even say what the use what i would normally say So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man-child. Who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why, why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative by mean a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. Yo, y'all yeah, know what whole babble is? Holy shit, bro, oh my God. Let's just go up here. Okay, moving up in the world. Let's do this. Now you might notice the darling rustic vibes this walkway is radiating, and that's no accident. I don't know what y'all are doing with your walkways, but if you're not spending a full hour pulling a splinter out of a snotty kid's finger, don't you dare call it authentic. Don't worry, the kid was fine. I'm a good counselor, and what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Yeah, you keep, keep wasting, what the phone is that? Look like a cell. Look like a didn't it look like a phone for a second with a green case. Anyway, uh, she not paying attention to her battery life. I mean, vlogging your potential death is, I guess, is cool. I guess then they know kind of what, like, what happened. But don't have a lead. I don't know. All right, that vision we just saw is going to come up on her section. This is where we're heading. Not too shabby. Well, literally is too shabby, but these views, oh man, you're gonna blow your tops. There's also a zip line, which eh, I guess you can watch me crap my pants on that thing. What the hell? I'm here, aren't I? 
I'm gonna carpe this DM so damn hard it won't know what hit it. But first, we gotta get there. And there's still so much to talk about. I hope Abby's okay. She ran off earlier. If you didn't see it, I kind of sort of made out with Nick. But it was a dare. I'm not like a bitch or anything. Oh, and for context, Abby likes Nick. Well, actually, they like each other. In truth, I just wanted to fan the flames a little. Watching them stumble around each other like drunk jellyfish was exhausting. Poor kid was like a deer in headlights. It's cool though, they're smart. They'll get it. I bet they're out there in the woods right now, just absolutely going for it. That's your motherfucking mouth. Car keys. Police car keys. I think this may be one of those, I'm sorry officer, I've no idea what you're talking about situations. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave those right there. And here we are, as promised, one extremely rickety and even more underwhelming tree house. In another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there. And oh look, it seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. See that right there? Wait a second. The way that that sound like she's trying to no uh nope. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly where we are. Look. Yep. There's our answer. So the, the tarot cards are important if you find them. Let me search the bag. And she I just feel like she just told us what's gonna happen anyway. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. there's something up there and it is not gonna make me jump I can promise you that much <sighs> goodbye cruel world the final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore Yo, 
Okay. Okay. There's two! There's two! There's two! At least. We might be fucked. Oh, God. <laughs> no, no, we're not blocking the door. We're not blocking the door. That's that's textbook. They always bust in. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. See, we wouldn't have been fast enough, bro. Wouldn't have been fast enough. And what the hell is that? Holy shit. I gotta take a breather. <laughs> I got to take a breather. Easy. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just. I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Oh man, I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola. Oh, yuck, I hate granola. <laughs> Those things have. Oh, it's right there. There's one right there. Did we get. Yes! Bro, sometimes they put these cards and you have a second, a fraction of a second to get it. That, whatever that thing was, had human eyes. The tarot cards that I got now will help me with the next chapter. Is my guy, yo. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something neat. Do those things turn you into one of those? You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Man, that's a good question. Do you think that whatever attacked them out there is, I don't know, has their scent or something? What? I don't know, like what if it got a taste for blood and now it's gonna track them down? I, I doubt it. I just feel like if we stick with them, we're sitting ducks, I don't know. I really don't think that whatever attacked them out in the woods is gonna get into the lodge. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're probably right. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Damn. Where are you going? I, I, I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. Well, say, go ahead, go to your death. Go ahead. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. The hell they ain't. That man leg was bit to the white meat. 
let's just say that's good news. Let's just be hopeful. Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? We gotta call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police? Ambulance? Huh. Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance, or can you just say, like, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, help, help. My friend may have been attacked by a bear, or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And we're not sure how many there are out there right now, uh, and or how smart they are, so they may be mounting an attack on us right now. So just, like, send a whole bunch of ambulances just to be sure. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. Okay. No mention of the guy with the, the overalls. Huh. Was this... What's wrong? Dead. That's convenient. Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though? It's a coincidence. Did you try the hang-up thingy? What? Here. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Yeah, you are. Right. Well, you know, how do you know that? Maybe that's just what they want you to think, man. Okay, so this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably rig something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay, just careful with it. I'll be fine. You got a gun wife? You can't have uh, it's, it's probably the weather. No, it's not the weather, dude! What, what weather, Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlyn. Should probably leave. Caitlyn's the one that was the best shot, right? When we were shooting the watermelons. Yeah, I think that was her. I, he, the way the way my man just handled that gun, I don't want him holding the gun no more. He ain't not built for this shit. Well, maybe we should just leave her with your gun. I'm a much better shot than you. You man. don't know that, okay? I might be an amazing shot. I might be. Just give her your gun. <sighs> I mean, the way bro came out, the way he came out, it's not time. So I could really think about this for a second. Even if it was, we could have paused it. Then it'd be real intense, though, if they start pa if they don't let you pause it when the timer's running down. 
We've been successful doing what the character said the whole time when they give their like their their inner thoughts a little bit. If he dies, we can always reload the chapter, bro. If anybody dies, I think we'll reload the chapter and then and then I'll show y'all correct correct decisions. But on the game like this, the decision I make now might not. You know, it might not affect anything for two or three chapters. I don't even know if we could do that. All right, bro. Uh, all right. You're right. Like, she should have a gun, though. Still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Yeah, she's she's too good of a shot to not have a gun. If, and if we're going to be with her, I'd rather her shoot the hell. My ass has got quite the bank account. <laughs> And I interrupted something? All right, so our best shooter. I'm trying to remember everything that happened so far when we make choices. She has a gun now. Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Right, I think. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. And I'm thinking, I rather, hey, look, I'd rather have the best shot live than him. I'm going to be honest with you. My man's, I mean, realistically. Quickly, man. Right there, ugly as fuck, too, bro. Man, get the, get the music, bro. I'm telling you right now, if y'all see a jump cut. It was because I had to turn the music down and it and it copy it did it, it hit copyright in like five seconds. That's all it takes. Can those things swim? That it, get this song off me. Okay, we get we get to see. Okay, that's the end of the chapter, but we get to see. We got those two cards. It'll tell us stuff about the next chapter. Everybody lives oh, another day. Good to see you. Good to see you. <sighs> A time again, is it? Strength. Strength can be surprising, 
knowing one's own raw power, tapping into it, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces at work within us all, and with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. The magician, <laughs> the incredible, the unbelievable, the mystical, sensational, perceptive manipulation, the work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. Blink and you miss it. And you wouldn't want to miss it. As always, there's more to see. And as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Man, that's, that face you make is scary as hell. Choose one. Choose wisely. By the way, a lot of the choices we make are based on the fact that I, you don't always want to make the obvious choice on these games. I think, I think when I played, everybody survived on Until Dawn, and like a lot of these games, like the obvious shit, it gets you beasted. Uh, can we see both? Yo, how he choking that big ass dude like that? So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you.